I've got Luke here, is that right? Yes, hello. No, no, I've got Luke here, yes? Oh, yeah. Yes, yes splendid. Yeah. Okay. I'll say hello if the time becomes relevant. Yeah. Hello, Luke. Hi, hello. Hello. And Andy. Yes. Is that right? Now, Luke, um, as I understand it, you were on a... I've seen from your claim at the council, you were on a, a reality TV show, am I right? Uh, previously, yes. Now, this is a very straightforward claim between friends. Mm. And it's fair to say, isn't it, Andy, that the two of you are still friends, even yes. though you've been brought to court. So it's rather sad, isn't it, Andy, that you've had to be brought to court to resolve this issue. Yeah. Luke, this is effectively a case about a piece of property that means a lot to you, something very profound. Some people have an emotional attachment to their property, family heirlooms, jewellery, that sort of thing. Yeah. What kind of property is this case about? Yeah, so this is about a games console that I've, I've brought here. But I would say I do have an emotional attachment to it, as it was a gift uh, I believe from my girlfriend. You. I yeah, see that. So. It was a, a gift from your... From your...? From my girlfriend, so... From your girlfriend. Yeah. I see. And it meant a lot to you because you bought it for what sort of occasion? Was it a birthday present? It, it was an early Christmas present, yeah. Did you get something on Christmas as well? I, I did. I was spoiled, yeah. Yes, I, I see that. No doubt she was as well. Of course, yeah. With presents or just your presents? Well, I've, both. I'm both, yeah. I see. So, Luke, you had this games console. And what would you... How long did you have it for? A few months, uh, maybe just less than three months. And how often would you play it? N potentially daily. Daily. You, you had a job, didn't you? I yeah, presume? but I, I worked it around my job. Worked it around your job? Yes. In between reading and museum visits and that sort of thing? No, no. I, unless there were virtual reading and virtual museum visits, I, I didn't really know. So this represented, other than your girlfriend, yeah. the mainstay of your social life? Absolutely. I mean, I would actively turn down events to play on this instead. You'd actively turn down events? Yeah. Do you want to come bowling? No. Do you want to come to the cinema? No. Do you want to go on your PlayStation? Yes. That was conversation you had with people. Oh, absolutely. Or yeah. was that bearing in mind you spent a lot of time with your console, a conversation you had with yourself? Quite possibly, yes. yes. And on people online as well, you know, yeah. American friends that I've made. You spend a lot of time with your virtual friends, is that right, Luke? Absolutely. Well, I mean, yes, I people. can believe you. Yeah, okay. Now, here's the thing me talking, you. I stop. Excellent. <laughs> so tell me about these virtual friends. Um, so, uh, you know, I have a headset that comes with the PlayStation that I bought. It was quite expensive. You bought that, not I, your girlfriend? I bought the headset, How much yes. was the headset? £300. Right. I bought the headset, and it's a state-of-the-art headset. It's wireless, I don't get tangled up, so, mm, you Sleeping know. and listening. Exactly. £300. My hands are free for the uh, controller. So I would go and... Let me tell you, with you and your games console, I don't even want to imagine what your hands are free for. <laughs> <laughs> So I would then be talking to the friends that I've made online. You play online. It's, it's a great environment, you know. M millions of people do it on a daily basis. People are doing it right now. Were friends disappointed that you, they'd lost you to the PlayStation? I think, I think they understand. I'm Judge Winder. I'm the sort of person that, you know, less is more. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to regret this, but do elaborate. <laughs> So, you know, I would see people maybe a few hours a week, but that's enough for me. I have a group of friends that sometimes they're just... Mm. You can do without. <laughs> now, you bought games. I understand it from your complaint. The game's quite valuable. Mm, yeah, they're expensive. They, co they cost a lot. Now, um, you bought one particular game. What was it called? Destiny. Destiny. Yeah. And this was a game that you'd play online with other um, game gamers, I think they're called. Ga correct, yes, uh, gamers. This isn't a game show. <laughs> don't mean, if you say, yes, I'm correct, you don't win prizes or your case. Right, oh, sorry. Right. What sort of game was it? An adventure game of some sort? It would be a RPG game or a shooter. It was more of a shooting game. You would shoot other people on it and you would shoot enemies on the game. So, in addition to speaking to your other virtual friends, you'd spend some time shooting them as well? Yeah, I mean, the idea is they would shoot me, I would shoot them, who gets the most points, you know, that's the idea. Mm. Sounds thrilling. 